Tax Refund 2022. Welcome back everyone so happy to have you back in today's video we are going to go over some of the reasons why you are getting a delayed message on the wmr for your 2021 tax returns what are some of the math errors on individual income tax returns that the irs may delay your refund this year as well as issuance of math error notices and why do the irs have the authority to make corrections to your 2021 tax return and we have an update on the backlog the amount of tax returns that are still waiting to be processed so make sure you stay tuned for that information as well let's go ahead and get started this information is being shared from irs.gov as well as the taxpayer advocate service the irs states that if the wmr tells you that they have received your 2021 tax return or are processing or reviewing it that they are processing your return but it may be under review they are working hard to get through the carry over inventory please do not file a second tax return so they are working the backlog as well as the current return as the return is processed whether it was filed electronically or on paper it may be delayed because it has mistakes in including errors and the ones that we already know are the recovery rebate credit the child tax credit missing information suspected identity theft or fraud or they uh, if they can fix that information without contacting you they will now here are some math errors on individual income tax returns tax calculation errors child tax credit adjusted gross or taxable income amount there could be errors with your w-2 which are 1099s education credits earned income tax credit standardized deductions there could be issues with the deductions that you're claiming first time home buyer credit repayment filing status if you file incorrectly the wrong status that can also delay your return Return, refund or amount owed adjustments to income uh, as well as withholdings and exemption so these are other things that can hold up your 2021 tax return for further review therefore delaying your refund beyond the 21 days now issuance of math errors when the irs makes a math error adjustment it will send the taxpayer a notice cp11 or cp12 informing you of the adjustment correction uh, balance due or corrected refund amount as well as the information on how you can dispute it if you disagree you have 60 days from the date of receiving that notice to dispute it if you choose to do so now the IRS have the right to make corrections map error corrections they were given this right by Congress Congress has given the IRS the authority to bypass normal audit procedures in favor of an abbreviated process known as math error authority so this this is in essence in order not to audit you which is a more serious condition the IRS have the author uh, authority to fix anything that they can fix in order to speed up the process and get you your refund faster all right it says this authority was initially designed to allow the IRS to ask, uh, access a tax liability by quickly resolving simple mathematical or clerical mistakes on your return all right also here is the update on the backlog updated on the irs.gov website february 25th 2022 the irs still uh, at this moment they have 8.1 million on process individual returns and that includes 4.3 million on process individual returns which include tax year 2021 so those of you that are still waiting on your 2021 tax refund the irs is still 
still working on those returns and currently have a backlog of 4.3 million all right so this is also a uh, cost and delays uh beyond the 21 days for you to get your current 2022 tax refund remember if they can correct anything they will make the corrections and send you a notice by mail they also are still working on the amended tax returns they currently have 2.1 million on process forms 1040x and it's taken them more than 20 weeks to complete those amended uh amended tax returns and you can check the status on the where is my amended return tool on the irs.gov website now if you are getting a refund status error information does not match remember that is an error with the irs system and not your information make sure you are putting in your correct filing status make sure you're putting in your refund amount before any deductions is taken out any fees is taken out as well as your correct social security number if you know you're putting that information incorrectly that is a uh, error system error with the irs website you just have to keep putting in your information remember you can check the status on the where is my refund tool the irs to go app but make sure you're not checking it excessively because you will get this error you see on the screen refund status error you have exceeded the daily limit on inquiries the irs states that they update once a day usually uh, uh, usually overnight so be careful not to check it too many times or you will be locked out all right make sure to comment and let us know if you did receive a math error notice from the irs if they made some correction did you agree with 